Hello, this is Huberto Horn, Jr., studying Business Administration, Concentration in Management from Detroit, attending Morehouse College, working on Professor Sinstrom, Google Fusion Table. First thing first is reading the directions. Fusion tables map all cells, change the icons from bucket, use all range that allows color to change, add wedging. So first I want to bring up my data. Now before going to data, it's something I want to show you all. Uh, I had to concatenate the information as far as street address, city, state, and postal zip code. Show you all real quickly. I'm going to undo what I did. So you want all of this to be on one cell. So when you're mapping it, also known as geocoding your data, it works. So create a new column. I'm titling this full address. Next I want to insert a function and once again we're doing concatenate now when doing this you want to add street address put spaces in between so you'll have spaces and you just go to each one of them a state oops, excuse me Post is of code finally and click enter. Now you see that the street address, city, state, and post postal code are all in one cell inside of one cell. Go to the right corner of the cell, drag it down. It will continue the template, the format for the rest of the cells. Now you want to save this and upload it to your Google Drive, and which brings you here. Now, next thing you want to do is map your location. But before you map it, you want to make sure that your location is set. So you want to go to type, make sure it's on location. And you don't need to have it in two column location, this one is fine. Save the changes, map location. Now, when you map location, it's going to bring this up to you. Now, he asks us to figure out the bucket list. I divide it into three buckets yellow, green, and purple. I also add a legend to it. <clears throat> so looking at the map, lo map location you can see the different sales as far as different ranges of prices and different zip codes by color. This is five hundred and twenty dollars. It's in yellow. And just tell you the range here. You can go something a little bit more expensive. It's a purple. Let's go to Washington. This cost sixty two six hundred and twenty one and nineteen. It's a sales price, but the sales is one million three hundred and twenty five thousand. Something in the green in Illinois. It's gonna be the mid range, so seven hundred and seventy-five thousand. So once again, this is how you geocode 
using Google Map Fusion. This is Alberto Horn, Junior Morehouse, studying Business Administration from Detroit. Hope you all enjoyed the video.